This tutorial will cover logging in for students and administrators. The easiest way to log in is to go to the site's unique web address, which is www.thesiteid.rhdiscovery.com. In this example, the site ID is Discovery Academy. So, www.discoveryacademy.rhdiscovery.com. We recommend providing this link on school and class web pages to make accessing the software easier for administrators and especially for students. Students will enter their user ID in the field provided and then press the Log In button. The student's full name is shown on the screen and the narrator asks, Is this your name? If the name shown is correct, the student will click the green Yes button to continue to the clubhouse. If the name shown is not correct, the student will click the red No button and will return to the login screen. Administrators will enter their email address in the User ID field and then press the Login button. The administrator's name is shown on the screen and a field is provided for the password. The administrator will enter the password and then press Submit Password to continue to the administration portal. Please note that passwords must contain at least eight characters, must be alphanumeric, so they must have one letter and one number, and can include symbols. If the password provided is incorrect, the administrator is instructed to check the password and try again. If the wrong password is entered five times in a row, the account will be locked and an email will be sent with a new password. To retrieve a password, click on the Forgot Login button, provide the email address requested, and press Submit. An email will be sent with a new password. Administrators and students can also access the software by visiting www.rhdiscovery.com. But the site ID must be entered from this web page in addition to the user ID. To log in to the Discovery app on the iPad, simply launch the previously downloaded Clubhouse app and follow the same process. Only students can log in on the app. Administrators must log in through a computer. One other improvement that should be mentioned here in the login tutorial is the auto logout feature. After 10 minutes of inactivity in the software, a message will pop up and the student is instructed by the narrator to click the button provided to continue using the software. The student has 30 seconds to click the button before an auto logout occurs. If the student is logged out, all user data is saved and progress is bookmarked. The auto logout does not apply to the administration portal.